A new quick action that was introduced in Mac OS Monterey was the ability to convert the format of an image without the need to install any additional software. One of the most common needs for installing these third-party apps was to convert HEIC photos, the default format for taking photos on your iPhone, to a JPEG or PNG. Now you can do this straight within Finder by right-clicking on the photo and choosing Quick Actions followed by Convert Image. You have a choice of formats you can convert the image to and a choice of image sizes which will help to reduce the file size of the image say if you intend to send it to someone by email. You can also choose to remove or preserve the metadata of the image, which is some of the information you'll find when you right click on the image and choose Get Info. When you convert your image, a copy is made, ensuring that the original version remains intact. Also, if you have several images that you need to convert, you can do these all at once by selecting them and following the same process. Right click on your selection, choose Quick Actions, followed by Convert Image. Different image formats will offer different quick actions. For example, here with my HEIC file, you can see that I also have the option to rotate and convert it to a PDF. But if we compare that to the quick actions that are available for this JPEG, you can see that I have an additional option now to add markup, which gives me several editing tools, among them the ability to crop the image like so. Just be aware that in this case, when you're editing the image, you are actually editing the original. Mac doesn't make a copy in this instance. All the quick actions in Mac OS can be found under Extensions in System Preferences. Here you can enable or disable actions by clicking on the box next to each one. And if other apps that you install make use of extensions, they will be displayed here too, such as this one from Microsoft which adds a quick action, allowing you to save documents directly to Microsoft's OneDrive. From this window, you can also enable and disable different sharing options and reorder the list simply by clicking and dragging each item. Finally, if you're looking for additional image formats to convert to beyond those available under Quick Actions, double click on the image to open it in preview and choose File Export. Here you'll have additional options to convert the image to formats such as TIFF and OpenEXR. So that is how you convert images on the fly using quick actions in Mac OS. Visit the website for lots more tips on all your favorite apps. And if you found this video useful, I'd appreciate you giving me a like and hit subscribe for lots more quick tips like this one. Until next time, thank you very much for watching.